As always, the latest version of IntelliJ Ideas supports more than just Java. IntelliJ Idea 2016.3 has support for running and debugging React Native applications from within the IDE. To set this up, go to Edit Configurations and create a new React Native Run configuration. After you've given it a name, make sure you've got the correct paths to your Node and React Native installations. You can run the app either as Android or iOS, and we're going to select Android here. You'll need a running Android emulator, so we'll start one from our AVD manager. When the emulator is running, we can debug our app. We start the app in debug mode as usual and wait for it to load into the emulator. There is one last step to get the debugger integration working. You need to enable remote JS debugging from within the emulator and this applies to both Android and iOS. Once everything is set up and running, you can debug your app as usual from within IntelliJ IDEA. The breakpoints you set will be hit at the appropriate times, and you'll be able to see the state of the application, the values of the variables, and so on. Of course, you'll also be able to step through the code and see what's happening. Most of the setup you've seen here is only needed the first time you run. Next time you debug the app, the settings will have been saved, so you'll be able to debug your React Native apps easily from within IntelliJ IDEA 2016.3.